do you think these structural guides have had maybe a negative effect on modern film and TV? Yeah, uh, you raise a really important question. Um, you know, I understand the mentality. I get it why people would want to simplify the process. Mm -hmm. You know, the, there's a structure to the plot. And if we can fill in these blanks, then that's screenwriting. Mm -hmm. Because it, 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 you know, it avoids a lot of the messiness, frankly, that exists when you do immerse yourself in the lives of your characters. Characters like us, like people, individuals, are complex figures. And so it's a messy process. Some of them may not want to talk to you. Some of them may <laughs> tell you lies mm -hmm. when you get to know them. But uh, so I understand the the idea of simplifying. And I have to say, whether whatever the intention of the writers are, some of these books have had, in my view, a detrimental impact on the, the, the perception of screenwriting. Like you can reduce it to these, you know, X amount of story beats and whatnot. And that... Frankly, I hear this from my screenwriter friends who are actively working in Hollywood now. They'll often get these notes that like a, a, a development executive who's a Stanford MBA and has no background in creative writing has read one book, a how-to book, and they're saying, well, no, no, you know, your, your, your act one end is on 31. It's got to be on 25. Most important thing about it is you mentioned it, feelings. I think that when you talk to development executive managers and agents, they want to feel something when they read new material. You know, they want to have an emotional experience. And so if you're staying up top all the time and just working on the plot, figuring out these events, that's just not going to get it. That's mm -hmm. just the, you know, to me, the path toward formulaic writing. If on the other hand, you do get to know your characters and you spend all, you know, you spend a significant amount of time living with them, not even thinking about plot. You're just getting to know them through a set of exercises and, uh, interviews and whatnot, that the plot will emerge from there. And moreover, the characters are going to be these richly multifaceted, divine, defined characters that actors are going to want to play, that people, when they read the material, go, I, I really feel something.